Hello, what's going on? It's Shiji Taco here, and I have the second Halo Loot Crate, and I wanted to compare it to the first so I could say which one I think is better. So I'll be going over all the stuff that comes in each, and you'll be able to check it out. Sorry if my camera doesn't focus quite right. It is my phone, because that's all I have with me at the moment. So in the first one, it comes with this jacket. You can go look in the first video a little more detailed. Um, then it comes with some documents that are like what it's like to become a Spartan uh, 4. And then it comes with this cute little statue. Probably can't see it too well, but it's two guys shooting at each other. And then it comes with that little pen on the left there. Mr. Chieftain, this folder that has the papers. And this little uh, like satchel bag. And then number two comes with this ODS t-shirt it says feet first into hell or little drop shock troopers or ODSTs and then it has a little pod and it's it's a nice shirt it's not too thin it's pretty decent in quality and then it comes with these like sweatpants that are they're pretty thin but they're still nice and it just says feet first into hell on one leg and then the rest is just all black and then it comes with these papers that are about the ODSTs during the battle of earth which is Halo 2, Halo 3, and ODST, and stuff like that, and Spartan Strike, but I'm sure nobody cares about that game. It's way underloved, if you ask me. And then it comes with these little pictures of New Mombasa. You probably won't be able to see them too well. They're just screenshots from the game, so you're not missing out on much. And then it comes with these, this uh, second statue here of Buck holding two SMGs. His face is pretty nicely detailed, and so is his armor, the pod, not so much. And it can connect to this over here uh, you probably won't be able to see too well but it's little pieces come together when you get all of them it'll form a little ring when you get all six of them and then it comes with these two velcros it comes with the ODST velcro it's just a little velcro drop pod and it comes with the little are you kidding me Virgil face and then the folder that all the papers for this one came in is just the same folder I checked all the numbers and stuff on it it is just the same folder, disappointing. And then it comes with this pen for the Battle of Earth. It's a little moon inside of a little sun. You can kind of compare. I'll actually put it next to all the rest of the Halo pens I happen to own. So you can kind of check out a bunch of different pens and compare them all. So it's got the two you already saw. The uh, Fire Team Osiris one. Swords of St. Helios. Uh, I'm sorry about my camera. Uh, the blue team one these are just emblems you can go look at all these emblems in game the spirit of fire for pax west and the banished for halo wars 2 both these are for halo wars 2 and then the boxes the box for the second one is a little smaller but it does have this nice hell jumper art on the cardboard box and the first one just has this little infinity and uh and a tower so that is all the stuff that comes in both of these uh, packs here. And uh, if I had to choose, I'd have to say the first one was probably a little more worth it, but the second one is still awesome. The really the part that really carries this one though is the second, or is the uh, two that carries the second one is the two pieces of clothing. If it weren't for that, it would not definitely not be worth it. But then it also comes. This one came with an emblem. And this really disappoints me. I thought I would get another emblem in this one, and I used the code for this. You also did not get a guidebook, like a little pamphlet that has like stuff and art in it. You can go check it out in the first book, or the uh, first video. And uh, that's honestly disappointing, and I thought I'd get another emblem, but I just got this same emblem again, um, which is pretty disappointing. It just gave me 9,000 RP, which is nothing. It's chump change compared for uh, like compared to like what you get normally, so that was really disappointing. You don't get an emblem, so it's a waste for the uh, rec packs for the second one. But that is all the stuff you get in the two loot crate packs. I definitely recommend it. It's like like high thirty dollars, like thirty five dollars or something, probably like forty after shipping, and uh, they come every other month, and I think they're pretty good. Um, thank you for watching. That'll be all.